Today we are going to talk a very, 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 very big word、mm. for Hong Kong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something that needs to be dealt with. Yeah. Start with a P. Starts with a P. That's right. Poverty. Poverty.、Yeah. Biggest. Yeah. Political issue. Biggest. Yeah. Policy issue. Yeah. Biggest problem、mm-hmm. in Hong Kong. Absolutely.、Go、P for poverty. Yep.、Yeah. P for problem. Yeah. T so, for policy. Yeah. All right. So triple P today. All right. So.、Uh, So what's going on? So in Legco, we are finally going to get the report of what the legislators learned when they went to Japan and Taiwan in August of last year. Oh yes, you have done a、well, special issue in Harbor Times. You could have waited until now in September. In September, yeah, yeah. Or you could have waited until now, you know. Or you could have read our paper back in September, which is you know September, October, November, December, January, February, March. <laughs> Seven months ago, we were way out ahead、September、of it. September, so, November, December, January, February, so, March. And it's almost April, actually. Yeah, it's almost April. So,、uh, so if you want to get ahead, you want to get a head start on this stuff, you know, check in with us. Okay, so here's the deal. So originally, the, the legislators were going to go like traveling all over Europe, and then somebody kind of said to them, "Well, guys,、uh, hello, expensive, wrong culture, not relevant." So then they said,、oh, "I guess so. Maybe, maybe the Eiffel Tower is not the way to go." You know. So、maybe. they they went to Europe to study poverty. Well, no, they didn't go to Europe. They changed their mind. <laughs> they tried to, they go, tried to, to Europe, go to Europe to study Europe poverty. poverty. And of course, they, they weren't going to the poverty-stricken Europe. Like、yeah. you know, they went to like nice. But then they said, "No, no, no, that's not a good idea." So instead, they went to Japan and Taiwan. And as you can see、yeah. here, you know, Japan, Taiwan, all those. And this is not. I have to reassure. This is not the flight path of MH370. No, no, no. This is yeah. This no, is a very different.、Not. Well, maybe. Who knows? You know. <laughs> There you go. We still don't know. <laughs> so okay. So our no, 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 no more, no more, no more, no more scandals. No more scandals. So poor learning. Today we're talking poor about poor relatives、yeah. of the、yeah. of the passengers. I know. I know. I know. Yeah. We shouldn't.、Uh, it's too early yet. Yeah. You know? All right. Okay, so what we're doing here is we're talking about what the legislators learned when they went, and so we asked them right when they went. We're like, what struck you the most about this trip、mm. to Taiwan and to Japan? And we got some of the legislators here. You can see some of them who got back to us. Alan Lang, Lang Yujong, yep, Paul Jae, right. Jung Kwok Chu, yeah, from the FTU,、uh, and、uh, Chan Yunha. There you go. All right. So they came back to us, and what did they tell us? I'm going to my notes here because it was back in September. You know? All right. Looks、uh, from Japan from and Taiwan. Taiwan. Okay, Alan Leong.、Uh, Taiwanese government's discussion of a basic living necessity plan to fight against poverty. So they basically went out and defined this is, you know, this is what you need to live, and then implemented that. So look for Alan Leong's influence in the report when it comes out today to、mm-hmm. say. You know, look at the specifics. That's a very American approach to the problem,、yep. and、uh, you know, because Americans did that. I remember it got to the point where they were like, "Oh, you need at least one TV and a VCR." Standard of living. Yeah. Try to match it. Yeah, but in Hong Kong, you know, we've we've kind of taken a numerical approach, but in places like this, they're like, "Oh, you need at least a refrigerator that's this big," and in the old days in the US, we'd be like, "And you have a TV, and you must have a VCR." You know, it was really specific. But、you、that's know, micro management. This, this, yeah, but that's how they did Running it. Running、so. risk of micro management. So、yeah. Hong Kong doesn't normally take that approach.、Yeah. Paul Jie, more in, more impressed by the cultural aspects of it, about how the Japanese community in Japan, how they pulled together as a community to help people out. Ah,、uh-huh. right. So he wasn't looking so much at the government solutions, but what the cultural influences are. So look and see if there's some of his influence in this paper、mm-hmm. when it comes out today.、Um, our member from the FTU,、uh, she was actually surprisingly, you know, unions. You think they're going to come up with something kind of a little bit to the left? You know, government should do this or hand out money, things like that, which are Unions here quite often do, but but, but <laughs> she was、uh, impressed with the fact that they looked at poverty and said the way to solve it is to make sure that our small medium sized businesses are more vibrant and put people、oh. jobs. That sounds like a very free market kind of thinking, which was surprising to hear from the FTU. But、uh, really, you know, no surprise. She she has been legislator of the week in our publication before, so maybe there's some original thinking going on. You know,、uh-huh. she's、uh, she's got something going on. So help the yeah. SMEs, yeah, to help the laborers. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You know, wow. So yeah, so that's you know that's, that's quite that's, a Republican that's, approach. Yeah, yeah, I think so. You know, from, from the FTU,、um, you know, another fellow kind of local,、uh, you know, kind of radical. Long、um, Yutong. Long Yutong. He was、yes. big on the Japanese government. You know, kind of providing. He was. He just was really interested in how they set up their shelters. Yeah. Right, providing food and、uh, shelter for people. All right. Right, which is funny because here in Hong Kong, maybe because the climate's a lot milder. Yeah. Uh, you don't see as much of that, and people actually resist it.、Mm-hmm. You know, I've talked to Matthew Chung about this before,、yep. and、uh, Secretary for Labor and Welfare, and he says, "Yeah, he says, you know, we we have people, and sometimes we try to like say, okay, you know, we're going to put you in shelter or housing here, and they're like, no, I don't want to go. It's too far from where I work.、Mm-hmm. I have a job." So he treats as a treat this as poverty issues as a housing issues. 
with yeah, shelters yeah, and all that. Yeah, yeah, But, you know, as I say, here in Hong Kong, they're a little more resistant to that. They're like, no, I don't think so. It's too far from where I work. I'd, right. rather, I'd rather sleep out here. Um, and uh, then our last legislator was impressed with Japanese Social Security funds. Zheng Guoqiu. Yeah, Zheng yeah. Guoqiu. And so he was impressed with Social Security funds and how they structured that. Okay. So look for all these influences in the report when it comes yeah. out today in Let's Go. I'm quite... Uh, but you, you know, you didn't have to wait seven months. I'm quite first. disappointed though, but yeah. because I think um, if you look at the numbers, yeah, you will see the Hong Kong poverty issues is highly correlated with, with. OH. age. Yeah. Um, in particular, we used to understand or we used to learn that Sham Shui Po is yeah. the poorest district, so yeah. all active district. Mm -hmm. But since there are more new buildings coming yeah. into Sham Shui Po and more middle class couples move to sure, Shem Shui Po. Sure, sure. Now the, the poorest district have moved to Kun Tong. Yeah, yeah. Kun Tong has become a very old town yeah. and the poverty issue has become worse. Yeah. But with the urban renewal of Kun Tong, I, I'm quite yeah. sure in the next five, ten years, yeah. the poverty issues will move away, yeah. possibly to Wang Dai Xin. Yeah. Because the district yeah. is getting really old now. Yeah. So I think old age and poverty has is highly correlated. Yeah. It's not only about shelter, it's not only about numerical uh, requirements. Yeah. So we have to solve the OH issues. I, yeah. yeah the I think problems related to OH. Absolutely. But it, not OH issues. People get old. We get old. Yeah. I, mean, yeah, we, I don't we, want people to see us as problems, right? Yeah. 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 Of course. You know. Yeah, of course. So we're, we're we can be, still contribute even yeah. when we get old, older yeah. and older. But the the, old, the issues related to the older population yeah. is highly correlated to all the old problems age. Re related to poverty. Yeah, and I think there's, you know, it's, it's, it's a problem. It's a problem of success in that, you know, it used to be people died at 60. So if you had a pension after 65, you didn't have to pay that many yeah. people. And the world has changed so quickly and lifespans have been extended so yep. dramatically so quickly that we just could not conceive of a world 30 years ago where people were living to 80, 85. Yeah, and right now, true. right now, we're planning for retirements on that. But I think people are going to live to be 110 all the time. And we're going to yeah. be like, oh, why couldn't we see this coming? Because we didn't expect that people like you and I were going to live to be 110. You know, as soon as they invent the artificial liver, I'm going to 120. Okay. You know, so I mean, you know, maybe we should be planning for people to live to 110, yeah. not 85. Yeah, we, we used to no long live the queen or long live the king. Yeah. But not long live the pension, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah that's what it is now, is long live everybody. So, yeah. All right. Yeah. So, so, so keep an eye out. Okay. And, uh, watch and see what our legislators come up with the report. This is what they were thinking right when they got back. Let's see what, on reflection, if that's carried through. Thank you, Andrew. All right, catch you later. Key reference today. You bet. Poverty. Poverty.